Hello friends, I welcome you all on your PD education. So in the lecture 3, I will say this exponent and power and uh, that is important topic for us. So I am going to discuss some more questions from this topic. So let's start this topic. Okay, now see this question. See this carefully. Uh, so when uh, I, I am giving with this question, so I have to take this value hai and I am given with this data. 5 power x plus x raised to power 5 is equal to 6250. Uh, See, when you add, I will say 5 power something, so the unit digit will come out to be 5 only. Okay, so similarly for that also. Okay, uh, let's say, so if I put x as 5, then 5 raised to power 5, in that I will also get the, uh, uh, see this uh, the unit digit for 5 raised to power something let's say a so the number i will get and the unit digit there will be 5 okay then 5 from here and 5 from here so i will get if you add these unit digits so you will get 10 you, you will get 0 in the unit digit after addition of these two numbers so that means Otherwise also, uh, I can try it like this, so by hit and trial, you can substitute 5 raised to power 5, x as 5, when I put x as 5, and here also x as 5, so that is this, 3, 1, 2, 5, 5 into 5, 25 into 5, 125, 125 into 5, 625, 5 raised to power 4 is 625, okay, 625 into 5, so that is 3, 1, 2, 5, 3, 1, 2, 5 plus 3, 1, 2, 5, so you will get 6, 2, 5, 0 concept here involved is of unit digit addition okay 3125 3125 so it will sum out to be 6250 okay so that means x here is 5 so just put the value of x x as 5 Sorry, uh, see here the correction is I will say here note 1 you are given with x here. So this is x note 1. So I will substitute 5 here. Otherwise you will not be able to solve this question. First 5 raised to power x by 5 minus x by 5 raised to power 5. So that was the question. Okay. And iski value nikalni if you are given with this. So that means x is 5. So 5 by 5. So that is 1. 5 by 5 1. So 5 raised to power 1 minus 1 raised to power 5. So that is nothing. 5 minus 1 is 4. So my answer would be 4. So you have to fill the integer value. Let's say the question was like this. So you have to un enter the number 4 through keyword, uh, through keyboard. Okay. So that was the first question for us. So I think must be clear with this question. Now see here, in these type of questions I will say, see the number of runs scored, runs scored by any team is equal to power of number of batsmen playing in the team. Okay. So that means I will say 6 power, uh, sorry. Uh, is equal to the power of number of batsmen. Batsmen ka jo number hai, uska jo power. Playing in the team. Thik hai, iska sum power, let's say x. Okay. To team A ke liye, aap dekho isme kya hai, do teams hai. Thik hai, do teams mein, team A mein 6 batsmen khel rahe hai. And from team B, 11 batsmen are playing. Okay. So team ab uske baad, there are two teams, team A and team B. You are given with two teams. If team A won by 95 runs, so team A, team B se, I will say team B se jada score karta hai and the difference of runs is 95. Haan ji. So can I write the number of runs scored by team A? Yes. So, if you know the number of batsmen, okay, and accordingly you can take the power there, okay. Now, the difference is 
आई विल से टीम ए हैज स्कोर्ड मोर रन देन टीम बी बट हाउ टू राइट द नंबर ऑफ रन स्कोर्ड बाय एनी टीम सो एज यू नो फॉर टीम ए सिक्स बैट्समैन प्लेड सो लेट से सिक्स रेज टू पार समथिंग लेट से एन इज एक्स फॉर टीम ए सो सिक्स रेज टू पार कुछ इज इक्वल टू द पावर ओके सेकेंड वन फॉर टीम बी इलेवन बैट्समैन प्लेड सो लेट से इलेवन पावर वाई तो नंबर स्कोर्ड नंबर ऑफ रन स्कोर्ड बाई टीम ए सिक्स पावर एक्स एंड द नंबर ऑफ रन स्कोर्ड बाई टीम बी इज इलेवन रेज टू पावर वाई ओके एंड द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द रन ऑफ दीज टू टीम्स इज नाइंटी फाइव बिकॉज टीम ए हैज वॉन दिस मैच सो यू विल सब्ट्रैक्ट द नंबर ऑफ रन ऑफ टीम बी फ्रॉम टीम ए एंड द डिफरेंस वुड बी नाइंटी now you have to find out the number of runs scored by team a now see uh, actually i will say these type of questions are done by hit and trial method hit and trial otherwise sometimes they will also give you the options also otherwise if you are given with with fill in the blank okay then you can solve this okay uh, otherwise they will give you the options okay so how can i solve this so let's say 6 raised to power 2 so that is 36 so that's not possible okay so let's take the minimum value let's take let's take the minimum value x let's take i take x as 3 x x 3 so 6 raised to power 3 so that is 216 now on the right hand side i have to make 95 11 as it is that will not uh, make uh, much of the difference why by taking y as 1 will not make much of the difference so let's take y as 2 so that is 121 and the difference will come out to be 95 am i clear or not yes so hence my equation is satisfied okay so that means the number of runs scored by team a was 6 power x and by team b was 11 raised to power y 6 raised to power x x is i will say 3 so that is 216 so they were actually asking the number of runs scored by team a so my answer was 216 by team b answer would be 120 ओके सो लेट्स डू अनदर क्वेश्चन नाउ If a power b is equal to 
थ्री पावर बी इंटू बी रेस्ट पावर बी ए बी सी बींग पॉजिटिव इंटीजर्स एंड ए इज इक्वल टू फोर सी ए इज इक्वल टू थ्री बी देन वट इज वैल्यू ऑफ b raised to power c a less than Yes, let's try to solve this question. A power b is equal to b power b into c power b. A b c being positive integers and a is equal to four c. A is equal to three b. Then what is the value of b power c? A less than fifteen. Condition you are given with. Okay. So when you compare this, so a power b, so that is a b c whole raised to power b. Yes or no? So when you split it, so that is again b power b into c b c power b. So that is nothing. Okay. So that means a is equal to b c. A is b is b c, and you are also given a is equal to four c. So when you compare this and this, so that will come out to be b is equal to four. B four हो जाएगा, and a will come out to be a is equal to three b. A is equal to three into four. A will be twelve. And c would be how much? C is a by b. A is how much? Twelve. And b is four, so c is three. C is three, so b power c would be how much? So that is, I will say, four power three, so that is sixty. A less than fifteen is coming, so that is twelve. Okay, so I think must be clear with this question. So let's do another.
Yes, so I think we can solve this question very easily. 3 power 5 raised to power x minus, okay, so just add it 6, 3, 1, 8 plus 2, 4, 3, 11, 6, 5, 6, 1. So, 3 raised to power 5x is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Haan ji, 3 raised to power 5 is 243. 243 into 3, 729. 729 into 3, 2187. Okay, then further, then you will multiply. So, I will say uh, 3 power 6, 79. 3 power 7, so, uh, this 729 into 3. So, that is 2187. Okay, and uh, this is 3 power 7. What would be 3 power 8? 3 7 the 21, 3 8 the 24 or 2 26, 3 1 the 3 or 2 5, 3 2 the 6, 6 5 6 1. So, that is 3 power 8. So, 5x is equal to 8, x is equal to 8 by 5. One mark question can be framed. Okay, so let's do another. If x raised to power m is 1 upon x raised to power n, then x power m plus n plus x power m plus n. plus x raised to power m minus n. Sorry, so I think visible near. Options are two x raised to power two m minus three by two three x power two m plus three by two two x two power two m plus three by 2 2 x raised to power 2 m minus 2 by 2 2 x raised to power 2 m minus 3 upon 2 3 x raised to power 2 m plus 3 divided by 2 2 x raised to power 2 m plus 3 divided by 2 2 x raised to power 2 m minus 2 divided by 2 Anji.
हाँ जी सो यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस इन टर्म्स ऑफ एम रेस्ट पावर एम सो वेन यू विल सॉल्व दिस सो एक्स पावर एम इन टू एक्स पावर एन तो एक्स पावर एम प्लस एन इज इक्वल टू वन वन इज एक्स रेस्ट टू पावर जीरो सो एम प्लस एन इज इक्वल टू जीरो सो एम इज इक्वल टू माइनस एन तो एम की वैल्यू माइनस एन हो जाएगी ये सो नो ये सो नो एक्स रेस टू पावर एम इन टू एक्स पावर एन इज इक्वल टू वन बेसिस सेम पावर्स विल एड बीच में मल्टीप्लीकेशन साइन वन इज नथिंग सो दैट इज एक्स रेस्ट पावर जीरो एम प्लस एन इज इक्वल टू जीरो एम इज इक्वल टू माइनस एन एम माइनस एन बन जाएगा ये सो नो तो एक्स रेस टू पावर एम प्लस एन एक्स रेस टू पावर एम प्लस एन एक्चुअल इट्स वैल्यू इज वन So wherever you are getting x raised to power n plus n, just substitute it with one, 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 one. So that is, I will say one plus one, two, one by two plus one. X raised to power m minus n. So that means n is equal to minus m. Okay. So I will say x raised to power minus m minus two m. So I will say so this will turn out to be like this. So that is three by two x raised to power minus. m okay and uh, when you will solve it so that is 3 by 2 plus 1 upon x raised to power 2m 3x power 2m plus 2 divided by this this will come out to be like this Yes, so this would be my answer, and uh, here the answer would become like this. So I will say uh, 3 into x raised to power 2m plus 2 divided by 2x raised to power 2m. Okay, so just correct here in the option x raised to power 2m. So I think must be clear with this question. So these type of question can also be asked if you are given with this, and you have to find out the value of this. So I think must be clear with this question. So my answer would become so that is this three uh, plus three uh, <coughs> x raised to power two m plus two. प्लस टू सॉरी सो यहाँ पर टू आना था जस्ट डू इट लाइक दिस सो प्लस टू डिवाइडेड बाई टू एक्स रेस्ट बाई टू एम सो माई आंसर वुड बी बी मस्ट बी क्लियर विद द प्रोसीजर हाउ टू डू दिस क्वेश्चन ओके जस्ट सब्सटीट्यूट द वैल्यूज जस्ट टेक द एल सी एम ओके सो वेन वाई टुक द एल सी एम सो माई आंसर बिकम लाइक दिस एंड हेयर यू हैव टू करेक्ट इन प्लेस ऑफ थ्री इट वुड बी टू and also in the denominator x raised to power 2m will be there so i think must be clear with this सेवन रेस्ट टू पावर फोर एक्स माइनस नाइन प्लस सेवन रेस्ट टू पावर एक्स माइनस टू इज इक्वल टू थ्री फाइव जीरो फाइंड वैल्यू ऑफ नाइन रेस्ट टू पावर फोर एक्स माइनस फाइव डिवाइडेड बाय
हाँ जी सो ट्राई टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन ओके सो लेट्स डिस्कस दिस 350 बनाना यार वी नो सेवन क्यूब इज थ्री फोर्टी थ्री एंड इफ वी एड सेवन इन थ्री फोर्टी थ्री सो इट विल कम आउट टू बी थ्री फिफ्टी ओके सो जस्ट ब्रेक इट लाइक दिस सो सेवन पावर फोर एक्स माइनस नाइन प्लस सेवन पावर एक्स माइनस टू इज सेवन पावर थ्री प्लस सेवन पावर यस ओ नो सो अकॉर्डिंगली नाउ यू कैन कंपेयर this this okay with this and this and accordingly you can find out the values of x okay there can be two values i will say two or three values if you compare 4x minus 9 with 3 then 1 then uske baad x minus 2 with 3 and 1 and accordingly you can find out the values of x just try to solve this question ओके सो लेट्स डिस्कस इट लाइक दिस फोर एक्स माइनस नाइन इज इक्वल टू थ्री और वन एंड एक्स माइनस टू इज इक्वल टू थ्री और वन ओके सो नाउ व्हेन आई टुक दिस व्हेन आई टुक एक्स हेयर एज थ्री एंड हेयर आल्सो थ्री सो एक्स इज फाइव हेयर एंड एक्स इज ट्वेल्व बाय फोर एक्स इज थ्री हेयर okay now when i took one hair okay and one hair so then it would turn out to be i will say 4x is equal to 10 so x is equal to 2.5 and hair x is 3 now another combination when i took i will say x3 hair and x1 uh, this one hair sorry not not x value is 1 so my 4x minus 9 is equal to 3 so x will come out to be 12 by 4 so that is 3 when i took so by green pen so x is 3 here by green pen x minus 2 is equal to 1 so x comes out to be 3 in both the conditions x is coming out to be same okay so that would i i will say 3 and 1 3 and 1 so x is 3 now accordingly you can check this equation put 3 here 3 here so that is i will say 4 3 the 12 12 minus 9 3 7 power 3 is 3 43 3 minus 2 1 3 43 plus 7 is 350 okay so that means x is equal to 3 we can substitute because for both the equations i am getting the same value so that is x is equal to 3 so 9 raised to power 4 into 3 i will say 4 3 the 12 12 minus 5 is 7 so that is 9 raised to power 7 by 2 so i think must be clear with this so 9 raised to power 7 by 2 you can easily do so that is 3 power 2 2 and 2 will get cancel out 3 power 7 
थ्री पावर फोर एट्टी वन थ्री पावर फाइव टू फोर्टी थ्री थ्री पावर सिक्स सेवन ट्वेंटी नाइन थ्री पावर सेवन टू एट सेवन सो आई थिंक मस्ट बी क्लियर विद दिस ओके सो लेट्स डू अन अदर क्वेश्चन A square is equal to B C. Value of Yes. So this is a question. So let's try to find out the solution for this question, the value for this. Okay. So let's try to do this. So yar, aise questions mein let us say. दिस वैल्यू इक्वल है सो लेट अस से वी आर हैविंग अ कांस्टेंट के ए पावर 5x इज इक्वल टू बी पावर 5 इज इक्वल टू सी पावर 5z इज इक्वल टू के ओके एंड यू कैन सी हियर नाउ सो दैट इज b पावर 5 एंड दिस इज c पावर 5z सो इन दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चंस यू विल से a इज इक्वल टू k raised to power 1 by 5x, b is k raised to power 1 by 5y, and c is k raised to power 1 by 5z. Okay, now put the value here, a square, so that will be k raised to power 2 by 5x is equal to bc. So b and c k raised to power 1 by 5y into k raised to power 1 by 5. Z. You are having the same base now, and in between you are having the multiplication sign. So that is k raised to power one by five, y plus one by five z is equal to k raised to power two by five x. Just compare the bases. K is same. K is same. So there will be two by five x is equal to one by five y plus one by five z. Five 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 will get cancelled out in the denominator. so you will be having 2 by x is equal to 1 by y plus 1 by z okay so that is nothing i will say so 2 by x is equal to y plus z upon yz when you take the lcm okay so on cross multiplying 2 yz is equal to xy plus xz xy plus xz minus 2 yz is equal to 0 iska value kya aa jayega 0 haan ji 0 to iska value kya aa jayega 0 ओके सो लेट्स डू अनदर नाउ एट्थ क्वेश्चन p 
पी पावर एक्स इज इक्वल टू क्यू क्यू पावर वाई इज इक्वल टू आर आर पावर जेड फाइंड वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वाई जेड जीरो वन सिक्स वन बाई सिक्स जीरो वन सिक्स वन बाई सिक्स यस P power x q, q power y r, r power z, p power six. Find the value of x y z. This type of question is oftenly asked, so I will say sometimes these type of questions uh, you will find with logarithm also. Okay. So just try to substitute the values of q in second. So this is my first, this is second, this is third equation. Just substitute the value of q from first in second. So in second Q can be substituted as p power x raised to power y equal to r. So p power x y is equal to r. Similarly, from third equation, this is third equation. This was second. This was first. R power z is equal to p power six. Okay. So how can I do? Uh, so this is so r is I will say p raised to power six by z. So just substitute r as p power six by z. P power x y base is same. Compare the powers. X y is equal to six by z. So x y z is equal to six. So I think must be clear with this question. हाँ जी सो दिस वॉज एट्थ दिस इज नाइन्थ नाउ इफ ए पावर वाई जेड अपॉन एक्स स्क्वेयर इज इक्वल टू बी पावर एक्स जेड अपॉन वाई स्क्वेयर इज इक्वल टू सी पावर x y upon z square d raised to power one by three and x plus y plus z is equal to zero, but x y z is not equal to zero. See the conditions are very important for us. Find value of x y z upon a y square 0 1 d so these are the options given to question can be made complicated i will say uh, like this we have uh, done in uh, like uh, you can get the question in some through some statements or by the use of algebra okay the question can be complicated
हाँ जी अगेन सम थिंग्स आर गिवन यू कॉमन दैट इज इक्वल सो लेट अस टेक एज कॉन्स्टेंट वैल्यू सो दैट इज के सो अकॉर्डिंगली यू कैन फाइंड आउट द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए बी सी डी इन टर्म्स ऑफ के सो जस्ट सब्सटीट्यूट द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए बी सी एंड डी इन टर्म्स ऑफ के हेयर ओके सो वट वुड बी ए ए आई विल से सो दैट इज के रेज टू पार एक्स स्क्वेयर अपॉन वाई जेड सो जस्ट सब्सटीट्यूट इट डायरेक्टली सो दिस इज के दिस इज ए फॉर बी your denominator will become numerator and numerator will become de denominator so k raised to power y square upon xz this is b so c is i will say k raised to power z square upon xy okay and d so that is k q now the base is same k and you are having the multiplication sign so i will say just add these powers x square upon y z plus y square upon x z plus z square upon x y okay divided by k ha ji Now I think you can do it. So k is the common one. Denominator or numerator? Me numerator denominator me k. X square upon y z plus y square upon x z plus z square upon x y. So I will take just take x y z in the denominator. So it will become x cube plus y cube plus z cube. Okay, and this three will come. upward so that is a minus 3 now this is the power of k k raised to power x cube plus y cube plus z cube upon x y z minus 3 so when you will take the lcm so it will become in the power x cube plus y cube plus z cube minus 3 x y z this is k raised to power i will i am saying and it will become this x y z and they are saying x y z is not equal to 0 now this term as you know that is of the form a q plus b q plus c q minus 3 a b c and it is further equal to a plus b plus c a square plus b square plus c square minus ab minus bc minus c a so when i will use the algebraic identity here so it will become k raised to power so this will become this x y z okay so that is not equal to 0 but x plus y plus z is equal to 0 तो ये तो जीरो है ना यार समथिंग रेस्ट टू पावर जीरो जीरो इंटू समथिंग सो दैट इज जीरो सो के पावर जीरो क्या हो जाएगा वन हाँ जी तो दैट वुड बी वन सो आई थिंक मस्ट बी क्लियर विद दिस तो ऐसा यार एल्जेब्रिक आइडेंटिटीज का भी यो यूज करवा सकता है जरूरत नहीं है जैसे एक्सपोनेंट एंड पावर का आपको कोई सिंपल ही क्वेश्चन मिले जैसे हमने कुछ क्वेश्चंस किए भी हैं हो सकता है ऐसा क्वेश्चन भी फ्रेम कर दे या स्टेटमेंट से कोई रिलेटेड क्वेश्चन फ्रेम कर दे कोई जरूरी नहीं है कि वो हर बार जो आपका जो इनका जो इंडाइसिस की जो प्रॉपर्टीज हैं वो ही वो यूज करवाए ठीक है तो उसके अलावा क्वेश्चन कम्प्लीकेट कम्प्लीकेट किए जा सकते हैं कम्प्लेक्स बनाए जा सकते हैं सो वी आर डूइंग दैट ओनली हाँ जी सो लेट्स डू ए पावर बी इज टू फिफ्टी सिक्स 
A is multiple of B, where A is multiple of B. X power Y is 256, where Y is multiple of If A, B, X and Y are positive integers, minimum value of find minimum value, these type of questions can be asked of A power X plus B power X. मल्टीपल है ए मल्टीपल है बी का और वाई मल्टीपल है एक्स का वाई इज मल्टीपल ऑफ एक्स दो ही रिलेशन हो सकते हैं यार दो ही रिलेशन हो सकते हैं फोर इज टू पार फोर इज टू फिफ्टी सिक्स हाँ जी मल्टीपल तो तभी होगा ए इज मल्टीपल ऑफ बी या तो ये दोनों सेम हो जाए ए इज डिविजिबल ऑफ बी यस और नो ए इज मल्टीपल ऑफ बी तो मिनिमम क्या हो ये दोनों सेम हो जाए वाई इज मल्टीपल ऑफ एक्स ठीक है तो या तो ऐसे हो सकता था ए इज मल्टीपल ऑफ बी ठीक है सो दिस इज ए एंड दिस इज बी यस और नो वाई इज मल्टीपल ऑफ एक्स अगेन फोर रेस्ट पावर फोर वाई इज मल्टीपल ऑफ एक्स y is multiple of x so x can be 2 y can be 8 so that also gives me सो ए फोर ए की वैल्यू फोर रहेगी बी की फोर रहेगी मिनिमम के लिए तो यही रखना पड़ेगा मुझे फर्स्ट इक्वेशन में सेकंड इक्वेशन में क्या हो सकता है टू हो सकता है और इधर एट हो सकता है ठीक है एक्स और वाई के लिए सो एक्स कैन बी टू वाई कैन बी एट और एक्स कैन बी फोर और वाई कैन बी फोर सो ए पावर एक्स सो दैट मीन्स ए एंड बी आर फिक्स फॉर मी I have a, I am having uh, only one choice, but for x and y I am having two choices. 
then accordingly you can check the value for these okay so when you will take y as 8 so i think this value will become more okay so when you will take this value so this is 4 raised to power 8 okay so let's do it like this 4 a is 4 b is 4 x and y are 2 and 8 so that will become 2 power 16 plus 16 now when i am taking x4 y4 a is 4 x is 4 a power x b is 4 y is i am saying so that is how much 4 so that is 256 plus 256 so that is uh, 512 so this is less than this value yes or no 4 raised to power 8 so that would be uh, very much high but we need to find out the minimum value so minimum value would be 512 for that i need to take x4 y4 and a and b is equal to 4 so my answer would be option a so minimum values question can be asked Okay, so let's do now. If arithmetic mean of AM stands for arithmetic mean of 5 minus 2 root 6 and another third is 7 minus root 6 minus root 14 what is the square root of other third Arithmetic mean of let's say A and B, you are having two numbers, so arithmetic mean would, would be A plus B by 2. So this is one third and another third, let us say X, then what is the square root of other third? So you need, need to find out the, I will say under root X, you need to find out under root X. Okay, so just do the calculation, 5 minus 2 root X plus X divided by 2 is equal to arithmetic mean given 7 minus root 6 minus root 14 so 5 minus 2 root 6 plus x is equal to 14 minus 2 root 6 minus 2 root 14 2 root 6 2 root 6 will get cancel out so x is equal to 9 minus 2 root 14 So, I will say just uh, make it like this 2ab, just make it like of the form 2ab. So, a is a 7, further root 14 will be root 7 into 2. So, a is 7, b is 2. Okay, so further 9 can be broken, uh, can be broken like 7 plus 2. Okay, so x would be, I will say root 7 ka square plus root 2 ka square minus 2 root 14 so x would be i will say root 7 minus root 2 ka whole 
square. So answer would be, I will say that is root 7 minus, so under root x would be root 7 minus root square root bhi nikal diya, arithmetic mean bhi usne aap se pata karwa liya. To ek hi question mein do chiz, arithmetic mean and square root kaise nikal diya. find value of Yes, very easy question. So let's make it value as this. X le liya mene. Let us suppose is let us this is x. Now again it is re repeating under root 42 plus under root 42 plus under root 42 up to infinity. So that is repeating. So this value again for me would be x. So just square, just squaring on both sides. So x square is equal to 42 plus x. So x square minus x minus 42 is equal to 0, x square minus 7x plus 6x minus 42 is equal to 0, x into x minus 7 plus 6 into x minus 7 is equal to 0, x minus 7 into x plus 6 is equal to 0, x is equal to 7, x is equal to minus 6. So, my answer is x is equal to 7. Or otherwise, I could have uh, broken this number into two, uh, like I will say x into x minus 1 form. So, that is 7 into 6. x is 7 and x minus 1 is 7 minus 1, 6. So my answer would have been 7. Directly, you can do it x into x minus 1. So I think must be clear with this question. So, often these questions appear in the exams. Find the value of Yes, so this is the question now.
okay so just open it i will say when you open it so that would be how much under root this is under root so that is power 1 by 2 so 4 raised to power 4 1 by 2 so that is 4 power 2 okay so you can write it like this 4 power 2 and further this 4 square is i will say uh, it is under 2 square roots so that is 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 so that is 1 by 4 so 4 raised to power 2 into 1 by 4 next also like this this 4 is i will say 1 by 2 1 by 2 1 by 2 so that is 1 by 8 okay and accordingly you can do this 4 also 1 2 3 and next 1 2 3 4 so i will say that is uh, uh 1 by 2 1 by 2 1 by 2 so that is 1 by 16 up to infinity हाँ जी टू इंटू वन बाई फोर सो दैट इज वन बाय टू ओके सो नाउ द बेस इज द सेम सो दैट इज फोर जस्ट राइट द पावर्स टू पावर विल गेट एड अप बिकॉज देर आर हाँ जी टू प्लस वन बाय टू this is 1 by 2 plus further that is 1 by 8 plus 1 by 16 up to infinity 2 plus 1 by 2 plus 1 by 8 plus 1 by 16 now you can see common ratio r is nothing so that is next term divided by previous term so 1 by 2 into 2 so common ratio is 1 by 4 and this is 1 by 2 divided by 1 by 2 1 by 8 divided by 1 by 2 so common ratio again is remaining the same so that is 1 by 4 so that means that is gp in finite gp and you are having the plus sign in between them so that is addition sign so sum of infinite gp is a upon 1 minus r because r is less than 1 so in the denominator i am taking 1 minus r What is the first term? First term is two. हाँ जी. One R is one by four. So two upon eight by three would be your answer. So eight by three. So that is four raised to power eight by three would be your final answer. i think must be clear with this question also so let's do another first 11 terms
Okay, so let's try to solve this question. Now this is up to first 11 terms. First is 11 power 1 by 2. Second is under 2 square root, so that is 11 power 1 by 4. Third under 3 roots, 11 power 1 by 8. Dash 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 up to 11 terms. One by two, one by four, one by eight, dash 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 up to eleven term. Common ratio again one by four upon one by two. So that is again I will say a GP. One by two, one by two square, one by two cube. So again common ratio is one by two and first term is one by two. Okay, and R again here is less than one. Sum of n terms in GP, so Sn is A into R is less than 1, 1 minus R is to power n upon 1 minus R, 11, so A is 1 by 2 into 1 minus 1 by 2 raised to power 11 divided by 1 minus 1 by 2, so that is 1 by 2, 1 by 2 and 1 by 2 will get cancel out, so you will get 1 minus 1 by 2 raised to power 11. हाँ जी 2 पावर 10 इज 1024 2 पावर 10 इज 1024 सो 2 पावर 11 विल बी 2048 2048 माइनस 1 सो दैट विल बी 2047 अपॉन 2048 एंड पावर वुड बी सो दैट इज 11 रेस्ट टू पावर दिस 2047 अपॉन 2048 दिस वुड बी योर आंसर तो 11 की पावर 2047 बटे 2048 आपका आंसर होगा ऐसे क्वेश्चंस में जीपी जीपी ले आया यार वो इसमें सो दिस वुड बी माय फाइनल आंसर सो आई थिंक मस्ट बी क्लियर विद दिस कुछ भी नहीं किया मैंने अगेन इसका एक शॉर्टकट भी बताया मैंने 4 टू 5 सीरीज में तो ऐसे भी कर सकते हो अगर आपको रिमेंबर नहीं करना है फाइंड द ज्योमेट्रिक मीन ऑफ
वन माइनस रूट टू एंड सेवन माइनस फाइव रूट टू फाइंड द जोमेट्रिक मीन ऑफ दीज टू टर्म्स जोमेट्रिक मीन क्या होता है सो दैट इज अंडर रूट ए सी जो भी आपको दो टर्म्स दे रखी है उनका मल्टीप्लीकेशन और स्क्वेयर रूट सो दैट इज द जोमेट्रिक मीन सो जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई दीज एंड टेक देयर अंडर रूट सो दैट वुड बी योर जोमेट्रिक मीन वन वन इन टू दिस सेवन माइनस फाइव रूट टू सो दैट इज सेवन माइनस फाइव रूट टू माइनस सेवन रूट टू प्लस फाइव इंटू रूट टू रूट टू सो दैट इज टेन सो दैट इज आई विल से सेवन माइनस फाइव रूट टू माइनस सेवन रूट टू प्लस टेन सेवनटीन माइनस ट्वेल्व रूट टू अंडर रूट ऑफ सेवनटीन माइनस ट्वेल्व रूट टू ओके सो दिस कैन बी फर्दर वी ब्रेकन इन टू ए बी टू थ्री द सिक्स सिक्स इंटू टू रूट टू सो ए इज थ्री बी वुड बी टू रूट टू सो ए स्क्वेयर इज थ्री स्क्वेयर नाइन बी स्क्वेयर इज टू रूट टू का स्क्वेयर सो दैट इज एट नो राट सतारा सेवनटीन सो दैट मीन्स दिस वुड बी अंडर रूट ऑफ थ्री माइनस टू रूट टू का होल स्क्वेयर so my answer would be so that is plus minus 3 minus 2 no uh, uh, i will say uh, i have discussed this square root in another questions also so again you have to take plus minus sign okay so friends i think ye samajh aa gaya hoga aapko chapter so these were i will say total 45 questions from this chapter and uh, i have tried to cover the variety of questions from this chapter okay so i will meet you next time with some different chapter till then keep watching your video thanks once again